Hey, welcome back guys, this is Crafty Fox, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build the LMS, which is London, Midland, and Scottish Railway uh, Princess Coronation Class 6233. So this was a high-speed uh, pasture uh, steam locomotive, and yeah, this is what it looks like. I did a poll recently of what type of train that you guys like best, and uh, steam came out way, way on top. So I really wanted to build a steam locomotive. Uh, the second was like diesel, and then third was like electric, and then last is maglev. So it's kind of like in the opposite, like the oldest was first and the newest is last. So um, yeah, that's pretty interesting. And uh, if you guys, you guys can still vote on the poll. It's on uh, my channel uh, discussion page. Um, but yeah, this is what it looks like. And let's get started. So the first thing we want to do, let's add the front. So we're going to take uh, red concrete, place that two blocks above the ground like that. And we're going to have pistons on the sides. Add a lever uh, down over here and towards the middle. Pull it down so we can extract these pistons. They could be our uh, buffers. And the middle, I use a lever. Just pull that down for the coupling. And let's add in these little lamps. So that's just a quartz slab on the sides. Next to that is nether bricks lab and behind that is nether brick stairs facing outwards and the inside part is going to be black wool and a black carpet right here all right so behind the piston there is a little ladder so I'm going to add a acacia wood stairs upside down and acacia wooden slab right underneath it and then we need to add in the boiler. So there's going to be um, like a cross shape, I would describe it as, or a plus sign right here dangling up. And yeah, it's like three blocks, three by three basically. So it looks like that. And it's four blocks long. So one, two, three, four. Extend the rest of the edges. And we're going to add in the corners using um, stairs, so nether brick stairs, all the way around. And another brick slab towards the back part, like that for the chimney, or smokestack, whatever you call it. And I added a sign right here saying 6233, just to make sure if you see this, you will know it's the coronation um, princess cor but, uh, Duchess of Sutherland. All right, and then we're gonna add a lever down here below it. And um, let's see, let's add in this wheel down here. So there's right behind this uh, ladder, there's gonna be a wheel. So add an axle right there, skip two blocks, add another pair of wheels using uh, black wool and we're gonna have another brick slab in between it. So it's like a two by three, and then it's fill in between the wheels as well. And uh, dark oak wood buttons on the sides of the wheels. And right above that area, we're gonna have uh, black wool. And I think I pretty much just filled it in. Let me check just in case. Yeah, I think we're just gonna fill that in. Just like the top section of that connect it to the front buffers like so and right behind this there is uh, three of these giant driving wheels so there's like uh, three blocks tall so start making those plus signs again so this is the first one followed by another one followed by another one do the same thing on the other side so once we know one side we just do the other, just copy it like a mirror, reflecting, and let's add stairs on the corners of it just to make it more round, like we do all our wheels. And um, yeah, these are some pretty big wheels that we have here. Much bigger than the 2x2 two two ones, which we're going to have in our um, trailing wheels. So there's leading wheels, driving wheels, and trailing wheels. All right, I think I did it right, or maybe not. No, I did it wrong. All right, so now let's add in, I guess, the cylinder right here. So there's going to be uh, two blocks of this uh, red terracotta. 
right in front of the last um, leading wheel like that, two blocks tall. Same thing on the other side. And in front and behind of the top section, we're going to have acacia upside down stairs like that. And towards the front, there's going to be another upside down one. I feel like I saw someone there like that. So it's going to slope a little bit down. And then we need to add in our smoke deflectors later. Not right now. Um, let's add some more um, black wool right here. You know what? Let's just fill in this entire section like that. And let's add in, you know what? Let's add in the smoke deflectors while we're at it. So there's going to be uh, two nether brick uh, what do you call it? <laughs> stairs. And then uh, there's going to be a third one, but we're going to face it forward like that. And the reason we're going to do that is so it curves around. So we're going to add um, a two by three of that. So add one, two, three, and then just add it. So it looks like that. Same thing on the other side. So it looks like that, and it should end for this black part ends. So once we do that, we're going to add in this red part. So let's start off from, let's do the bottom part. So let's start off right there. And then I apparently miss this one. So let me, oh no, I missed this entire corner. So. I have to fill that in right now before it's too late. And then I have to redo this part. And then we're going to add red terracotta and we're going to make it 13 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then once we get after 13, we're going to add in um, like a 3 by 3 like this at the very end. Then pass it right behind it on the sides. We're going to add three blocks tall red concrete. Let me check if I'm doing this right. Actually, maybe it's three blocks tall, but we're going to dip down a bit for the cab area. And then we're going to have two more red terracottas like this down here with yellow terracotta above it for the numbers. And acacia wooden stairs, two of them like that for the cab windows. And above that, there's going to be um, another brick stairs, three blocks, a row of three. And inside of that, there's like a three by three, another brick uh, slab like that. And we're going to extend it so it does like an overhang. Like that And there is like one slab in the front of that. All right. And then we need to add in this section. So that is six or five, five blocks. So one, two, three, four, five. Extend the rest so this is the box area near where there's smoke box or fire boxes. And there will be <clears throat> acacia wooden buttons on the sides of this. So there's going to be like four of them. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Then we're going to actually replace this bottom corner with acacia stairs and then fill it in towards the front like that so it's all acacia down here fill in the rest of the boilers so that this section right here is just going to be like rounded out so sort of like the black part so let's do that right now add in acacia wooden stairs on top And skeleton skull that's going to be adjacent to uh, this, the middle of that wheel. Actually, oh my god, I forgot about it. So we're going to add the skull. Let me fix up this um, these bottom wheels. I totally forgot about them. This is my mistake, but, you know, at least I caught it right then and there. But it's not that big of a deal. You can always go back and try to fix stuff. All right, so once we do that, we can add in that little bump right here. So just, so just skip two away from the skull. Add a queso, um slab like that. Cool. So now let's add in um, a queso slab, and that's going to go across all the way right here towards the cab. Same thing on the other side, and then I'm going to fill it in with um, black carpet on top. So 
should go all the way to the cab. Black carpet, like so. Oh no. <laughs> I hate when that happens. When I like misplace a block. So black carpet on the side. And then we're gonna uh, add a red terracotta right here, right above uh, the middle of the last wheel and the middle of the first wheel, like that. Same thing on the other side. Okay, now let's add in uh, this these rods. So there's gonna be, um, I think it's a double, yeah, two doubles, and then two singles. Then two doubles again, and then three singles, like that. So that's pretty much the design that I have. So was it the top one? Yes, it is. So two, then two, then three. All right, now let's work on this area. So there is, wow, it's really hard to see <laughs> since it's black. So. Let's add in the trailing wheel right here. So we're going to skip two away from this um, this giant driving wheel. Let's just skip two. Add in our Oreo wheels. Like that. Just a two by two nether brick. Like a so. And then we're going to have a black, black wool right in front of uh, this whole section right here in front of that trailing wheel and then in yeah on the top part as well let's fill that in you know what we go all the way to the end of the cab like that so it's kind of like the flooring too and the bottom part we're going to fill in the middle between these wheels and extend it towards the back it looks like it goes all the way let me check right here just in case okay it does so we're going to extend it all the way to the end of the cab and then extend that by one like that. And there is also uh, these two nether brick stairs back to back upside down. Just on the outside of this a driving or rather trailing wheel. And we're also going to add uh, two of these acacia wooden slabs like that. And the inside part, there's like three, it looks like it's three, three of these uh, nether brick fences, like so, right behind that wheel. And then this section, I'm going to make it three blocks wide. Add acacia wooden stairs upside down to the edges, and acacia wooden slab like that to the end, uh, or the bottom rung of that ladder. At the top part, we'd add another brick stairs. And there's some um, gray concrete, so let's add a two by three right here. All right, so let me check. Okay, so it looks like the bottom of this tender, I made it gray, so. Oh yeah, I forgot to measure the tender. <laughs> All right, so let's add in a red terracotta right here on the edges. And we're going to make it 10 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then we're going to extend it by 1. And then wrap it all around. Same thing. And then we're going to add in the wheels. So there's going to be a wheel right behind this ladder. So get our Oreo wheel. And hopefully we're going to get this right. All right, it works. So another uh, two by two wheel. And then skip two, add another pair right there. Another pair right across. I remember when I had no idea what adjacent meant. <laughs> like I would hear that in the mission Halo, Halo 1. But now I know it means across. In case you don't know what adjacent means, it means across, okay? So, oh no, I just accidentally deleted that. Alright, so we're going on our last wheel, which is great. 
cool so once we have all our wheels now we can add in the back part uh, three block row of red concrete pistons on sides and levers to pull them out Whoa, it's a little bit laggy there. Okay. We're also going to add um, another brick fence right there. And we also need to add <clears throat> red terracotta in between all of these wheels. And yeah, just go across all these wheels like so. Because there's like a red bar. Once we do that, we're going to add red concrete on the inside part of these wheels. And then um, let's add gray concrete just for the flooring of it. And then um, in the back, we're going to have a little like C shape using red concrete and then Next to that, we're going to make that two blocks tall like that. And let's add, let's make this part two by two actually. I'm going to start off with the <laughs> the yellow, so we're going to have yellow Kong. Terracotta, I mean. Put one, skip a block, add one, skip a block, add one, so that there's three of them. Space the part like so. Add red terracotta right around them. Like that. And the front, I'm going to add another one right here with acacia uh, wooden stairs. And on the sides, we're going to add acacia wooden stairs as well. Uh, the back one faces the back, and then we're going to have the rest face the side. Then we're going to make uh, the inner wall. So the inner wall is black concrete. It's like a 3x3 three three right here. There's another wall in the back. Um, let's actually add uh, another brick uh, slabs right here to fill in this floor. Like a two by three of black concrete. And it's really hard to see, but there's a black concrete right here in the middle and another brick fences on the sides of it behind that. Uh, two by three, another brick or black concrete, I mean. On top is another brick slab, three blocks. And over here, another brick slabs as well. Then we can add in the coal. So the coal, there's going to be a three by two right here. Then slopes down a little bit, and I added a three by three of coal. I know if you want, you can just fill it in all the way. It doesn't really matter. And then we're going to have stone button right here, right above that fence. And also, before I forget, I need to add in uh, this little banner right here. So let me do that right now. So to make it, we're just going to take um, crafting table, a uh, black banner. So I'm grabbing it right now. Usually I have it already prepared for the tutorial. So we're going to take a black banner, add a rose red dye all around the border like that. Then we're going to add a 2 by 3 on the bottom. Uh, two thirds of that banner, and then we're gonna have our uh, window banner. So we could place that in the front of the cab, so it can look out the driver, or it just looks a lot better if you have that included. All right, so back to the tender. We're gonna have these back-to-back -back nether brick stairs in front of all of our um, trailing wheels. And then we're going to connect the spaces in between using nether brick slabs. Once we get into this, so take our nether brick slab, add it in between so they're all connected. And it looks a lot better if you have like a black stripe across. All right, cool. Now let's um let's examine this locomotive. See if we're all done here. We don't want to leave anything behind, but from what I can tell, I think we're uh, pretty much done on how to build the LMS Princess Coronation Class um, 6233 Duchess of Sutherland in Minecraft. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, remember to hit that like button down below because that really 
helps the channel grow and subscribe if you haven't already because I will be uploading more train tutorials like this in the future. And if you have any suggestions, you can leave a comment down below or you can tell me this build is really awesome and please do more or something like that. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.